horses. Kit's going berry picking. Mmm, nice juicy raspberries. They look and smell delicious. Kit wants to eat them, but wait. What about Brushy, Puffbert, and Glubus? Kit's wrapping the berries to take to his friends. That's nice, Kit. They don't know they're in for a treat. Got crushed. <laughs> the wrappers. <laughs> the berry juice made patterns. <laughs> Kit has an idea. <laughs> Tying up the wrapper made a different pattern. <laughs> Let's see what different juices can do. Different colored juices and different ways of tying the wrappers are making all kinds of pictures. Nice one, Kit! That's one huge wrapper! They've tied different parts in different ways. By putting the squeeze on fruit, they really let their creative juices flow. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. Fruits come in lots of colors, and you can squeeze their delicious, natural juices to make tie-dye prints. You'll need thick paper towels, rubber bands, and some different color fruit juices. Start by folding the paper towel over and over again at different angles until it's about as wide as your thumb. Take a couple of rubber bands and wrap them tightly around the paper. If the towel is bigger, use more rubber bands. Then, pour a little fruit juice on each section of the towel. You can use different colors on different sections and mix colors within sections. When you're done coloring, carefully take off the rubber bands. Then unfold the towels slowly so they don't tear. Let the towels dry and enjoy your fresh squeezed works of art. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone, let's get rolling. Music is a special kind of art. A wonder song's about to start. Take that frown, turn it upside down, and just like that, it changes to a smile. And for a while, you forget what you let upset you so. Whoa. And take that pout, turn it inside out. And now those lips are ready for a kiss And just like this, a sad face Is erased, replaced with love 
It's Glubus. <laughs> Kit has an idea. <laughs> that looks like fun. Glubus thinks so too. Uh oh, he can't get to the top. What's that for? Oh, Kit made a stairway! It worked! There's Puffbert. He wants to bounce too. <laughs> Can they get back up that way? No, but sliding down was fun. <laughs> <laughs> they made it into a slide. Brushy and Creon will love this. Oh no, he's stuck again. <laughs> it's broken. But they'll make more. full of rides and slides. Now that's how you roll. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. Folding and rolling paper is a fun way to make unique art projects. Get some colored papers, scissors, a glue stick, and tape. Bend, crease, and curl your papers into lots of different shapes. The paper will keep the shapes you make. Let your imagination run wild, but be careful with scissors and always ask a grown-up if you need help. When you're done cutting, glue some strips together to make a slide. Then build a tube tower with a paper base and a top like a tree. Where glue's not strong enough, use tape to stick things down. Arrange the pieces any way you want. No rules here. With these rides and slides, it's you who decides. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. <laughs> Wonder Balls make music, too. Here's a song just for you. Wish upon a shooting star.
ba 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 ba. How now, cow? Wow! There's nothing Kit likes better than a nice cold glass of milk. It looks like Tinta is really thirsty for milk, too. Luckily, Kit is more than happy to share. It appears the glass is a little too tall for Tinta. Tinta better hurry or there will be no milk left. It's almost all gone. Tinta didn't get any milk. And Kit didn't even know. Of course, Kit will pour another glass. Oh no, that was the last drop. Is there any way Kit can cheer up Tinta? An idea! <laughs> Look who's here! It's Globus! I wonder what Kit needs some glue for. <laughs> I guess the moral of this story is, when you run out of milk, don't get sad. Get busy, using your imagination. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. This project is not only fun, it's nutritious too. Drink some milk and then collect these items. Use a glue stick on the sides of the milk carton and then attach some white paper to cover it all around. Ask an adult to help you cut pieces of colored construction paper into an assortment of shapes and sizes and then glue them onto the sides of the carton. You can use straws, tubes, or other items to create the tail and the legs for your milk carton cow. Finally, it's time for the head. This one's just an example. You can make it any shape that you'd like. Have fun with your design. This will work with any type of beverage carton. So even if you don't drink milk, you can still have a cow. Wow! Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. Shots. They won't all go in. Give it to me. 
give it all you got. And one step That's back. how you win. La, 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 Crayon Creations. Crayon loves seeing what kind of shapes he can draw. Meanwhile, Kit just finished giving Brushy a haircut. Crayon has always wanted to get a haircut too. But the problem is, he doesn't really have any hair. But maybe Kit can still trim a little bit of crayon off Creon anyway. Wow! Creon looks fantastic! <laughs> Look at what a mess the crayon shavings have made. What can we do with these? <laughs> Robo Ball is here to help. <laughs> Wow, it's a star-shaped mold. It's the kind of mold that's heat-resistant. <laughs> Kit's being extra careful handling the hot mold. The crayon shavings melted into the shape of the mold. I wonder if it will work with other shapes. A circle. Another star. Into the oven they go, and... Ta-da! What a great idea to use crayons in a whole new way. Robo Balls thinking about all of the different shapes they can try. They molded a bunch of different colors into a rocket ship shape. Three, two, one, blast off! When it comes to imagining new crayon creations, the sky's the limit. The Wonder Balls made art. But that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. Gather up as many crayons that you can find. The more colors you use, the more colorful the shapes will be. Here's what you'll need. Make sure an adult helps you with the toaster oven. With a piece of plastic, 
shave pieces off of the different crayons. You can group the shavings into different color combinations. Sprinkle your color piles into shape molds on an oven-safe tray. Now, ask an adult to place the tray into a toaster oven. Remember, you're the artist. Let them handle the hot stuff. The heat melts the crayon shavings. And once it cools off, you have your very own crayon creations. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. When you have something that's on your mind, it's time to make some art. And if the right words are hard to find, it's time to make some art. Make an artistic choice to help you find your voice. You don't need to speak, cause pictures say it all. Let everyone see how creative you can be. When you have something that's on your mind. It's easier than ABC. It's time to make some art. Everybody can and wait to see. The right words are hard to find. Your imagination sets you free. It's time to make some art. Why not say it with art? Stuck on Leaves It's autumn, the season when leaves change color and fall from the trees. Glubus is decorating sticks with red and yellow leaves. Kit loves studying all kinds of leaves. <laughs> He's collecting different types in his scrapbook. <laughs> Puffbert likes leaves too. He especially likes blowing them up in the air and watching them drift back down. <laughs> Puffbird's sneeze is way more than a breeze. It's more like a hurricane. Kit lost his leaf. And they almost lost Glubus. <laughs> the leaves! <laughs> They're stuck to his sticky head. <laughs> Glubus isn't happy. But now that he sees the leaves, he loves the look. <laughs> Maybe there's a way for Puffbird and Kit to get that leafy look, too. <laughs> Puffbird's gathering leaves, and so is Kit. They each have a big pile. Now what? Glubis <laughs> is sticking them on. Glubis and Kit use the bright leaves of autumn to decorate themselves. 
What a creative, colorful way to celebrate the season! The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. You can use leaves, greens, and small branches any time of year to make your own colorful crown. You'll need paper, leaves, scissors, glue, and double-sided tape. Look for clean leaves in parks and gardens. Have a grown-up help you pick safe ones. You can use small branches and pine needles for your crown, too. Cut a piece of paper in half and glue the pieces together end to end. Cut triangles out of one side to make it look like a crown. Use your double-sided tape to stick the leaves, branches, and needles to one side of the paper. Leave room at one end and tape the two ends together for a colorful crown that your friends won't be leaf. <laughs> Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. Music is a special kind of art. A wonder song's about to start. Take that frown, turn it upside down. And just like that, it changes to a smile. And for a while, you'll forget. What you learn upsets you so Whoa And take that pound Turn it inside out And now those lips are ready for a kiss And just like this A sad face Is erased, replaced with love Oh It's a whole new world It's a whole new world it's a whole new world When you spread a little sunshine Then the darkest nights become better tomorrows And the moon will follow Round and round we go Brushy's doing a great job painting all of the white playground equipment with beautiful colors. Uh-oh, it looks like he ran out of yellow paint. And he used up all the blue paint, too. Time to go for more supplies. Look who's here to have some fun! It's Hugo, Tinta, and Kit! Oh no, the blue paint is not dry yet. They're rubbing it off the seesaw. Brushy just finished working on the slide. All that wet paint is being wiped away. These guys are really making a mess. Now they're heading for the merry-go-round. can is full of red paint. Brushy's back with his supplies. Red paint certainly made an interesting design. Brushy has an idea. Wow, that looks amazing!
Ashi couldn't stay mad at his friends for long. Not when there's so much fun to be had. Now that's a colorful merry-go-round. Spin art creates really cool patterns that are always one of a kind. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. You can try this at home by making your very own spinner. It's a good idea to ask an adult for help. These are all the materials you're going to need. My favorite item is the marble. Attach white paper to a CD or disc. Use two-sided tape to hold the marble to the bottom and more tape to stick a straw to the top. Make sure it's exactly in the center. Now spin the top quickly and once it gets going, squeeze paint on the top. You can spin it again and again and try different colors each time. And here's the best part. No two designs will ever be the same. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. <laughs> Wonder Balls make music, too. Here's a song just for you. Wish upon a shooting star. Mix it up. Brushy's busy painting the playground equipment. Oh, but he's all out of paint. Here come the Hugo brothers. They can solve the problem one, two, three. Slides done. What's next? Looks like the seesaw is. Blue and yellow for the middle parts. More paint. Blue, yellow. Red! Oh no! Brushy needs green paint, not yellow! Blue won't do! Maybe the Hugo brothers have an idea! Blue? He can't use blue. Yellow's not right either. Oh no! Hugo put blue paint in the yellow! It's green paint. 
Made by mixing the colors. Brushy wants them to make more colors. White and red. Mix them together and what do they make? Pink. Now the Hugo brothers are mixing up all new colors. Red and yellow make orange. What happens when you mix blue and red? Purple! Sometimes the way to make something new is to take what you have and mix things up. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. You can paint with lots of different colors by mixing just a few basic ones called primary colors. You'll need water to clean your brushes and some paints. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Paint wherever you want those three colors first. When you're finished, use a clean brush to mix equal parts blue and yellow to make green. Take red and blue paint, mix them with a clean brush, and you've got purple. Mix yellow and red together and you'll have a bright pumpkin-y orange. Use your three new colors to paint the rest of your picture. But you don't have to stop there. Experiment with new combinations to create your own mixed up colors. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. When you have something that's on your mind, it's time to make some art. And if the right words are hard to find, it's time to make some art. Colors are a language understood by one and all. Make an artistic choice to help you find your voice. You don't need to speak because pictures say it all. Let everyone see how creative you can be. When you have something that's on your mind, it's easier than ABC. It's time to make some art. Everybody can do it. The see. right words are hard to find. Your imagination sets you free. It's time to make some art. Why not say it with art? Fruit stamps. <laughs> Kit has spotted a bunch of different fruit. I guess apples are his favorite. Here comes Tinta. Looks like apples are her favorite fruit, too. Kit's wondering what to do about this. Kit's trying to cut the apple in half with his ruler, but it's not working. Watch out, Brushy! The apple spilled the can of green paint. The paint got all over the apple. It can't be eaten now. Brushy just made an exciting discovery. 
The inside of the apple left behind an interesting pattern with the green paint. <laughs> if it worked once, will it work again? But maybe this time with a different color. <laughs> Kid is excited to see if this will work with other types of fruit, too. It does! Look at the pattern the orange made! Let's try it with all different fruit! The inside of each fruit has its own texture that makes a unique pattern when you use it as a stamp. <laughs> now you know, fruit is not only good to eat, it's great for painting too. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. The secret is using tubes of paint. They make it easy to squirt out just a little bit of color at a time. Here are some items you can experiment with to try to make different things into stamps. Ask an adult to slice fruits and vegetables in half so you can reveal the textures and shapes on the inside. Then just rub the fruit into a blob of paint and start stamping. You can also try portioning out different colors and then use a paintbrush to apply paint to the fruit, vegetables, or any other item you want to experiment with as a stamp. The best part? There's no wrong way to do this! Just follow your instincts and pretty soon you'll have a stamp art masterpiece! Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone! Let's get rolling! Music is a special kind of art. A wonder song's about to start. Take that frown, turn it upside down, and just like that it changes to a smile. And for a while, you'll forget what you let upset you so Whoa. And take that pout, turn it inside out And now those lips are ready for a kiss And just like this, a sad face Is erased, replaced with love Oh, it's a whole new world It's a whole new way it's a whole new world When you spread a little sunshine Then the darkest nights become better tomorrows And the moon will follow Out of the Shadows Creon and Spencil are having fun drawing and coloring. Hmm, what's this? It looks like a drawing, but it's not very colorful. Maybe Spencil and Creon could brighten it up. It's starting to look like something. Huh? It's a bird! Ah, that wasn't a drawing, it was the bird's shadow! Creon
Leon and Spencil traced the shadow, colored it in, and their picture looks just like the bird. <laughs> Tracing crayon shadow made the shape of crayon. They're calling their friends to show them what they made. They're telling their friends about the shadow picture. Kit, Brushy, and Puffbird really like it. Creon and Spencil want them all to make shadow pictures together. Brushy's shadow looks like a bird standing on a perch. Kit's shadow <laughs> looks just like a crab. That's a carrot and a bunny. There's a squirrel, and you know what that is. All those amazing animals from just a little light, a little shadow, and lots of imagination. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. We're gonna use toy dinosaurs, but you can use whatever you have to make shadow drawings. Just get some crayons and colored pencils. Place the figure so a light will make shadows on your paper. You can move the light to change the size and shape of the shadows. When you have the shadows the way you want them, use a pencil to trace the outlines. Now you can take the toys away and start coloring. You don't have to copy the colors of the toys. Color any way you want. With your pencils, add eyes or other details to make the creatures look however you like. And just like that, you've made some shadows come to life. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone, let's get rolling. Music is a special kind of art. A wonder song's about to start. Take that frown, turn it upside down, and just like that, it changes to a smile. And for a while, you forget what you let upset you so. Whoa. And take that pout, turn it inside out, and now those lips are ready for a kiss. And just like this, a sad face is erased, replaced with love. Oh, it's a whole new world. It's a whole new way to be. It's a whole new world. When you spread a little sunshine, then the darkest nights become better tomorrows. And the moon will follow. Going Spiral When it's cold, Brushy loves to go ice skating. He practices a lot, and he's really good at it. Kit and Puffbert are very impressed. <laughs> Looks like they decided to get in on the fun. Oh. 
I guess it's not as easy as Brushy made it seem. <laughs> <laughs> Puffbird isn't able to get himself going at all. <laughs> the ice is very slippery. <laughs> Puffbird has an idea. <laughs> now this should help him move around and keep his balance. <laughs> Puffbird picked up a little too much speed. <laughs> Straight for Kit. <laughs> Maybe ice skating is not for everyone. <laughs> Wow, they made a cool design on the ice. <laughs> Whoa, how will Kit be able to keep his balance? With a helping hand from Brushy. Kit is finally feeling confident on the ice. Puffbird's making some pretty nice moves. As they spin around, they create swirly trails in the ice that make twisting patterns. Now that's what I call going spiral. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. You can create designs like these using simple household items. Remember to ask an adult to help handle the sharp objects. Have your adult helper puncture some holes in a few different plastic bottle caps. They should look something like this. Now, wrap a rubber band around the side of each plastic cap. Place a roll of tape on a piece of paper and put the bottle cap inside. Put the point of a pen in one of the holes in the cap and start rolling the cap around the inside ring of the roll of tape. Switching holes and changing pen colors will make a variety of spiral patterns. Try experimenting with different size caps and rolls to get some amazing results. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. A good day becomes a great day when you're not on your own. Fun times coming your way if you don't roll alone. Just try sharing with another to fill your world with color. Like one plus one is always true. Here's another thing that's always true. Between you and me and me and you, everything's better with friends. Side by side until the end. A way of life I recommend. It's not so hard to comprehend. Everything's better with friends. Moving pictures. <laughs> Happy birthday, Puffbert. Time to make a wish. 
He's Puffbert's cousin. <laughs> Filmbert's famous for taking beautiful photographs. <laughs> Filmbert wants to take a picture of Puffbert and his cake. <laughs> That's a great shot! <laughs> Kit, Brushy, and Glubus want a picture too! <laughs> Filmbert's going to take a picture of everyone together! Bye-bye, <laughs> Filmbert. <laughs> At least Filmbert left his pictures behind. <laughs> The pictures seem like they're moving. <gasps> Looks like Kit has a plan. <laughs> a paper cup, some paper, glue. What are they making? took of Sparkle are moving, just like a movie. Teamwork put a whole new spin on pictures. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. This is a zoetrope. It makes still pictures look like a movie. You can make one, and you don't even need a camera. Here are all the things you'll need to make your own mini movies. Start by drawing some funny faces near the bottoms and tops of five strips of sticky note paper, like this. Stick a strip inside your cup and have a grown-up cut narrow slits on both sides of the paper. Do it four more times, then snip off the slits. Next, put glue on the backs of the strips and stick them inside the cup. Make sure a bottom face always goes next to a top face. Have a grown-up cut an X in the bottom, then stick in a straw to make a handle. Now you're ready to go for a spin. Twirl the straw with your hands and enjoy your moving pictures. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. When you have something that's on your mind It's time to make some art And if the right words are hard to find It's time to make some art <laughs> Colors are a language understood by one and all Make an artistic choice to help you find your voice You don't need to speak cause pictures say it all Let everyone see how creative you can be When you have something that's on your mind It's easier than ABC It's time to make some art Everybody can wait to see The right words are hard to find Your imagination sets you free It's time to make some art why not say it with art? 
rock and roll garden. Kit has a picnic planned for Tinta and Hugo. And he's brought some tasty treats. Uh-oh, the breeze might blow the blanket away. Good idea, Kit. That rock should hold it down. Now it's blowing the other way. Kit's afraid that the two rocks won't hold. Let's see if this does the trick. It works! Oh no! The wind's just too strong! They solved one problem, but created another. Now there's too many rocks and no room for them. They have an idea. Wow, they painted the rocks and made a beautiful butterfly. Looks like Kit's ready to rock and roll. What can they make from these rocks? It's a flower! and a little imagination helped Kit, Tinta, and Hugo create a full-blown rock garden. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. To make your own rock garden, find lots of different shaped rocks and pebbles. Just wash and dry them before you start. You'll need the things you see here. Pick five flat rocks and one round one to make a butterfly. Use twigs to make the butterfly's antenna. You can use rocks and pebbles to make all different kinds of flowers, too. Add little twigs for stems. Once they're arranged, paint the rocks one at a time. Use any colors you'd like, or leave the rocks unpainted. It's up to you. Here's the best part. Your rock garden will be in bloom all year long. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. A good day becomes a great day When you're not on your own Fun times coming your way If you don't roll alone Just try sharing with another To fill your world with color with friends.
with friends. Everything's better. Better with friends. Don't you forget everything's better with friends. Everything's better. Everything's better with friends. Don't you forget everything's better with friends. Light from the dark. Creon drew a beautiful gold star, and he's very proud of it. Oh, there's Murky. Wherever Murky goes, everything turns black. Oh no! He's covering Creon's star! <laughs> Creon's excited to show Kit the star. <coughs> Poor Creon. <coughs> Kit has a plan. <coughs> Detective Kit will solve the mystery of the missing star. <coughs> The star is gone for good. Oh, it's Brushy. Whoa! Brushy brushed away the black. Wherever he touches gets erased. They've discovered a whole new way to draw. <laughs> this is perfect for making a snowman. And it's shining even brighter than before. <laughs> Things looked dark, but our friends found a way to make a snow scene that's merry and bright. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. Using pencils to draw a solid background and erasing to make pictures is called negative drawing. That's the point of this project. You'll need some pencils, erasers, and crayons. Sharpen lots of erasable pencils. Trust me, they wear down fast. Fill your paper with pencil marks. Don't press too hard, just cover the sheet. You can make the background dark or light. Be patient, this could take a while. When the paper's filled in, use the edge of an eraser like you'd use a crayon to draw the outlines of a winter scene. Use crayons to add colorful details. With negative drawing, you'll erase your way to a winter wonderland. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone, let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along.
gotta face the facts For every two steps forward, take one step back Take your best shots They won't all go in Move two steps forward And give it all you got That's how you win Light as a marshmallow. The Wonder Balls are looking for their campground. But it's dark. Hugo's got a bright idea. He's using glow in the dark paint to light things up. <laughs> They're here. This is the campground. What's Kit making? <laughs> it's a picture of a campfire. They're pretending to toast marshmallows. Kit's having a little problem. Problem solved. Puffbert wants to try. <laughs> now it's Hugo's turn. Aw, he missed. One more try. It's stuck on the stick. <laughs> Hugo's paint made the marshmallow glow, just like the stars. <laughs> Those stars look like a dolphin. <laughs> A long time ago, people imagined pictures in groups of stars and called them constellations. <laughs> that looks like Ursa, the little bear. a bird called a phoenix. That's Castor and Pollux, Gemini twins. Our friends created marshmallow constellations that shine like the stars. The Wonder Balls made art. But that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. Marshmallows have the squishy, squashy, puffy stuff you need to make your own glowing constellations. You'll also need glow-in-the-dark paint, toothpicks, and sticks. Squeeze out some paint and dip your marshmallows. When the paint is dry, Connect the marshmallows with the picks and sticks to make constellations. Squeeze paint onto the sticks and draw around your constellations to create your creatures. Then turn off the lights and enjoy the glow of the wonder-filled night sky right before your eyes. Now 
Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. A good day becomes a great day when you're not on your own. Fun times coming your way if you don't roll alone. Just try sharing with another to fill your world with color. with friends. Side by side until the end. A way of life I recommend. It's not so hard to comprehend. Everything's better with friends. Everything's better. Better with friends. Don't you forget it. Everything's better with friends. Everything's better. Everything's better with friends. Don't you forget Everything's better with friends. Soak up the fun. Rushy and Hugo are having fun with paint. That's their sponge friend, Absorba. When he's not wet, he's no fun. <laughs> They want Absorba to paint, too. Maybe he'd like blue paint. Or maybe Absorba just needs a push to get started. Well, they may as well have fun. Uh-oh. The rain's getting their drawings wet. What's that squishing sound? It's Absorba! Since he's a sponge, Absorba really loves water. The rain's done! Absorba's all dried up. Wow! Look at what Absorba made from Brushy's drawings! How did he do it? Hugo knows! Absorba soaked up the wet paint. Now they can all paint together. <laughs> Absorba, Hugo, and Brushy are each making their own special shape with the paints. All it took was a little rain to help this pretty painting blossom and grow. The Wonder Balls made art, but that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. You can make an amazing painting without touching a brush. You'll need a sponge, some paints, and a bunch of cotton swabs. Take a few swabs, but don't dunk them all the way in. Just touch the tips to the paint and let the cotton absorb it. Use the swabs to dot your paper with paint. Try taking a few swabs and dipping them together to make lots of dots all at once. 
Use your sponge to dab on even more paint. You can use your finger to add some final touches. There are so many ways to paint. You don't have to stick to swabs and sponges or even fingers. Think of new things to try and then soak up the fun. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone, let's get rolling. Wonder Balls make music too. Here's a song just for you. Wish upon a shooting star. Ba, 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 ba. Going spiral. <laughs> when it's cold, Brushy loves to go ice skating. He practices a lot, and he's really good at it. Kit and Puffbert are very impressed. <laughs> Looks like they decided to get in on the fun. I guess it's not as easy as Brushy made it seem. Puffbird isn't able to get himself going at all. <laughs> The ice is very slippery. Puffbird has an idea. Now this should help him move around and keep his balance. Puffbert picked up a little too much speed. He's heading straight for Kit. Ice skating is not for everyone. Wow, they made a cool design on the ice. Whoa, how will Kit be able to keep his balance? With a helping hand from Brushy. Kid is finally feeling confident on the ice. Puffbert's making some pretty nice moves. As they spin around, they create swirly trails in the ice that make twisting patterns. Now that's what I call going spiral. The Wonder Balls made art. But that's just the start. It's your turn now. Here's how. You can create designs like these using simple household items. 
Remember to ask an adult to help handle the sharp objects. Have your adult helper puncture some holes in a few different plastic bottle caps. They should look something like this. Now, wrap a rubber band around the side of each plastic cap. Place a roll of tape on a piece of paper and put the bottle cap inside. Put the point of a pen in one of the holes in the cap and start rolling the cap around the inside ring of the roll of tape. Switching holes and changing pen colors will make a variety of spiral patterns. Try experimenting with different size caps and rolls to get some amazing results. Now you can use your imagination to make your own creation. Come on, everyone. Let's get rolling. It's time for another wonder song. Let's make some noise and sing along. A good day becomes a great day when you're not on your own. Fun times coming your way if you don't roll alone. Just try sharing with another to fill your world with color. Like one plus one is always two. Here's another thing that's always true. Between you and me and me and you, everything's better with friends. Side by side until the end. A way of life I recommend. It's not so hard to comprehend. Everything's better with friends. Bum, bum, bum. 